chance to look over that Ferg application. Uh, oh. Should I tell my daughter yeah, Marcus? I don't understand why everybody wants to be basketball. Let them catch it. Maybe one of the state championships the old ones. The old ones are money. Let's see. Who's the top thing at all? I was going to ask you where food is, but I don't care anymore. Well, I hate to tell you, but you turned out to embarrass me today in the kitchen. But... How do you burn a salad? We have a new cook. Is this the wine you're serving? Yeah, you've got a beautiful smile. Well, thank you. I've you can't serve my teacher's shot of me. You're in, don't you? Yeah, I'm Taylor. She's the good stuff. And you're in the camera. Good stuff is not dinner with a teacher. And good stuff is third jumper could use some work. Ah, here's your order. And it's not even burned. This must be your lucky day. Here, let me help you with that. Oh, great. And when you're done with that, table three needs to go. You know, it's really funny because I opened a fortune cookie today and said if I ever met a girl named Taylor, I should ask her for a foot dance. Uh, me? To the dance? Thanks. But I can't. I just have to work and stuff. Come on. Come on. from three. Two boats with uniform on the left. Hello? But I like the one on the right. But I bought the tickets. But the good and line. you can go to the Okay, one boat for each. You got it, homeboy. Oh, no, okay, that is definitely the last time. If you want, I can show you the website where I got all of the information on Mendeley's theater. Ten more? Does Julie know about all these girls? They're not girls. Sounds like a good idea. Okay, this is where I stop asking questions. I just want ten more votes, not you. But don't tell Julie, okay, please? Fine. Thank you. You know, we could play this uniform thing for a lot more money. But there are friends who can't squeeze money out of them. It might get us enough for new cheerleading uniforms. The ones that glow in the dark? I love that. Reach for your dreams, honey. Taylor, wait up. I just wanted to clear the misunderstanding ahead at the stadium. You want to go? What misunderstanding? When I asked you to dance, you said no. No, no, I understood you. Good. So I'll pick you up at eight. Sure, sounds like But I can't go. Sorry. Well, what if I get someone to cover your job? Thanks. It's hard to explain, but I can't. Uh, so you need time to Thanks, think. <laughs> Give me your number, I'll call you. Uh-oh, good. Sorry. Be sure to take that show for that one. No day. Go, Cupid. No number. You, you, How you are stinking up the court. <laughs> it's time for a new strategy. Why don't you just ask another girl? Yeah, there's only like 700 of them that want to go out with you. I don't know. There's something about Taylor. Something in her eyes. I can't stop thinking about her. She just seems cool. Yeah. It was cool the way she turned you down. <laughs> I'm gonna follow her home and talk to her mom and dad. Come on, my bike's in the shop. You're driving. What if her parents don't like you? Parents love me. I'm like the son they never had. My parents say that about me, too. Yeah. <laughs> Are you sure you saw Taylor come in here? Yeah, I'm sure. But this is a homeless show. Oh, here. Why people with no... I take the stupid science show. She's probably a volunteer here. Oh, I see. Man, she's even better than I thought. Hi, and Karen. I'm sorry. If I were anybody else, I'd say she was too good for me. I am somebody else, and she is too good for me. Hey, there she is. I didn't mean to hurt you. Hey, 
Come here often? Nick, what are you doing here? I don't mean to bother you, your volunteer job, but I can't stop thinking about you. Uh, that, that's really nice, but you have to go. You uh, don't want me to get in trouble at my job, do you? No, but we've got to talk. We'll talk tomorrow. Now, go, 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 go. Gee, I hope you're a little nicer to these customers than you are to us. Hey, look, I can't wait until tomorrow. I'm going to wait outside until you finish here. No, you can't. Then I'll help you here. Look, I don't work here. My family and I are living here until things turn around. You mean your home? more money for voting for it. And I hear Michael got a nice bump in the old allowance this year, if you know what I mean. He didn't. Oh, he did. He bought ten extra tickets. And that's ten votes for the ugly one. Oh, that's so low. Yeah, yeah. Give me 20. You're doing the right thing, Julie. Nice stock a date go. Did Taylor say yes or call the cops? She said no. And then visiting hours ended and we got kicked out of the shelter. What shelter? What are you talking about? Taylor and her family are homeless. They live in a shelter. Terrible. She's homeless, but she seems so normal. She is normal. Things just got messed up at home. Her dad lost his job and then her mom got sick. They ran out of money and ended up on the street. Well, isn't her dad looking for another job? Yeah, but it's not that easy to find one that pays enough. And since they have no family in town, they had to move into a shelter. You know, this soup is pretty good. <laughs> Poor Taylor, I mean, having no place to live would freak me out. I could sleep in a room full of strangers. No, I mean, there was a lot of chicken in that soup. Said, no way that stuff came out of the can. Nobody cares about the soup. You just tell them they just seem so embarrassed. I bet Taylor is. Let's not let her know we know. Hi, guys. Hey, guys. How's everything at home? I blew it. Hammer's told you guys, right? Taylor, it doesn't matter to us. I, um, I better get back to work. Taylor, listen. The fact that you're homeless doesn't bother me. Well, it bothers me. It's humiliating. It's all I think about. I hate it. I'm sorry. Look, maybe if you had some fun, it would take your mind off for a while. Come to the dance with me. Nick, even if I wanted to go, I, I don't have anything to wear. Please understand. I just can't go. Listen, Ben, you gotta quit calling, man, because I'm telling you. And I remember, we're not letting her out of here until she borrows this dress. We don't want to embarrass her, so act natural. I'm not. Mary Beth, this dress is hot. Are you sure it's okay if I borrow it for the full court dance? We're girls. We always share things. Yep, that's what us Listen, girls do. Dude, you gotta quit Can I borrow that hot you. red dress? You know, that DKNY? DKN? Why not? <laughs> <laughs> we are such girls. I love sharing clothes. <laughs> Gee, I'm a girl. Do you Listen, think I could borrow a dress too? Well, of course you can. This would look great on you. Go with your oh eyes and your hair. Chrissy, we're busted. <laughs> Guys, I know you're trying to be nice. Come on, Taylor. Just go to the dance with him. He really likes you. It'll be fun. We're all going. And we really do borrow each other's clothes all the time. It's no big. 
We're girls. That's what we do. No, really. Well, can I wear the red one? Sure. I wanted the red one. I mean, it would look great on you. Thanks, guys. You guys are walking like a couple of old ladies. Because of Katrina, the ballet witch. She was a pain in the butt. Being such babies. Now, do me a favor and hand me a cup. Coach, they're right funny. I know. But I can't move either because of that meanie ballerini. So, which uniform got the most votes? Yeah, I wonder which one will win. <laughs> well, we can't tell you guys. Top secret. But we raised a thousand dollars. Whoa, that's great. Hey, Taylor. Looking good. Oh, this? It's uh, just something I borrowed from a friend. I'm glad you decided to come with me. Like I had a choice. <laughs> Actually, I'm glad you said that. You guys are so cute together. Yeah, you're all that or bag of chips, girlfriend. <laughs> Enough with the snaps, Moesha. Excuse me a minute. I'm gonna go steal a few cookies for later. What? Kidding. I'm going to the restroom. <laughs> Wouldn't it be really great for Taylor? A smart little handbag? No. Why don't we take the money we raised for the uniforms, which we don't really need, and give it to Taylor's family? That's a great idea, Christy. Yeah, if it's okay with the rest of the team, I'll go clear with Coach. Okay, I have a few quick announcements. One, nice turnout. B, whoever made the brownies, thumbs up. Next time, add walnuts. Team manager Mary Beth Pepperton and our new forward Nick Hammer. Hi, we have a very special announcement about the new uniform. Yeah, the team decided to do something better with the money. What? Are you hiring the Pacer girls? <laughs> I wish. Actually, the team voted to donate the money to a good cause. Hey, I'm a good cause. Get me a PlayStation and surround sound, baby. I I'm trying to be serious here. The money's for someone in our class. Yeah, someone named Hammer. You can't just change your mind with our money. It's not for me. Yeah, sure. We want a refund. Refund! 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 Give me a break. We're just trying to help out Taylor raise her family's homeless. And Dad has to be sensitive to those feelings because he's dead. Taylor, I didn't mean to. on the other hand, can do this. I was writing a novel. I just overheard you on the phone telling A little paint, a few throw pillows, I can turn this place into That's a palace. Smart, <laughs> Look, TJ, this is your first crush. Man, I never expected to see so many, many families. Yeah. This is really sad. It's sad that he's very in a place where like these people can go until they get like back on their feet. Which explains why some people leave in boxes and cars. Man, I feel like such an idiot. I can't believe I embarrassed oh, Taylor in front of the whole school. You may be a genius. Taylor, look, so I'm sorry. Thank you, Brett Hammer. Everyone here already knows I'm homeless. Look, I'm sorry. Those guys at the dance were just ticking me off. It just slipped out. Why didn't you just wear a t-shirt that says, I'm with Charity talk. Girl? Oh. We were just yeah. trying to help. And it occurs to here. me that even though I saw her first, We want your family to have it. You know, maybe she's more your type. And I Thanks. think the sporting thing for me to do would be to well, look, step aside Look, I really and appreciate this. And as soon as my dad gets a job, we're going to pay you really? back. Well, why is he having such a hard time finding one? Well, when you don't have your own address or phone, it's hard for people to reach you. But there's a payphone here. Yeah, that's great. Hello, homeless shelter. I mean, it doesn't exactly make my dad look like someone they want to hire. I get it, son. Maybe we can help. I mean, you've got the seven of us. Look, between my dad's car business, Rico's dad's construction business, and Mary Beth's dad and every other business. With all this helping your dad look for a job, something's got to turn up. Yeah, and your dad can use my cell phone as his own private line. But if any cute guys call, make sure he takes a number. I'll surf the net and check for jobs. Are you sure you want to do this? You don't even know my family. Hey, you're Hammer's friend. 
That makes you our friend. And that's what friends do. Don't worry. Things have a way of working out. Thanks, you guys. Put the two under the hard four in your set. <laughs> All the resumes we sent out, I can't believe Taylor's dad still doesn't have a job. After scanning all the classifieds on the internet, you couldn't find something. I, I did. I found the recipe for that homeless shelter suit. The problem is, you can only make it for a hundred. Not with this suit. Thank you. It must be so frustrating when you can't find a job and you need one. I mean, Taylor's father has a lot of experience. We couldn't find him anything. The only thing we can do is keep trying. Hey, guys. Hey. Hey, what's up, hey, Taylor, what's happening? Well, good news and bad news. Good news is I quit my job. You quit your job? And the bad news is your order's burnt again. You burned my root beer? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. My dad got a job. No, right. <sighs> Everything you guys did really helped. I don't know how to thank you all, but thank you so much. Let me get your order. This is so great. So tell me everything. Where's the job? Well, that's the hard part. It's in Michigan. We're moving in a few days. Oh. I'm glad things worked out. Nick, thanks for all your help. Well, looks like you're leaving. Just when we were getting started. I'll only be a few hours away. Maybe I'll come up for spring break. Nick, I'll never forget you. I'd, uh, better go. <laughs> hey! I'm not letting you get away this evening. You ran out of the gym before to get the last dance. Then I guess I owe you one. <laughs>